But another challenge. I kind of like X-Ray. That seems hard. Knife's Edge is also kind of ridiculous. Uh, when blind is selected, destroy Joker to the right and permanently add double its cell values to this multi. I would love to get Egg. If we get Egg round one, we put Egg hardcore like to the left of Ceremonial Dagger and then we just keep feeding Dagger whatever we can get our hands on. And we just let Egg cook. Absolutely let Egg cook. But that's in a perfect world. I doubt it's going to happen. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. Egg, 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 egg. Uh, for this one, we kind of just need... <clears throat> we don't really have anything special, so I'm trying to just go for a flush here because uh, a flush is easy worth uh, 300. Typically worth at least 300. There it is. 310. We do miss out on the discards a little bit but that's fine we did not get anything doubles max money uh it costs three so we'll go down to seven up to 14 that's free four dollars we take it plus one card in shop Ooh, that's expensive though i'll hold on to it for now doubles my money oh my god all heart cards are debuffed and it's 600 and i have like i'm working off nothing 14 bucks all all 14 dollars i need i need a bunch of money for ceremonial dagger to just keep throwing stuff into it uh here let's do two pairs not gonna get me a whole lot and we're kind of in the same boat no matter what i do here So I was perfect. Okay. I was hoping for something that I can play for at least 300 here. And then if I can get another flush, um, which is unlikely with only one discard left, but I can discard all five. Uh, I have eight more clubs. So, you know, I have about even chance of drawing a club as anything else. And I have five chances. I need to draw two. Oh, we didn't get there? It's fine. I'll just play whatever. It's only a high card here, and that's fine. I have three more hands to play. We might not. Oh, I say we might not get it, and then we absolutely bink it. Hell yeah. We got through anti one uh, with no buffs, pretty much. And just a lot of money. Oh, hello. Earn $1 at the end of round, gains $2 when boss blind is defeated. All skill. I might actually Hieroglyph here. Because Hieroglyph will slow everything down a little bit. Uh, I'll grab a to-do list just for the base foil on it. Oh, oh no. Sells for three. I can't move. I can't. Ceremonial dagger is always to the left. Oh, balls. Pinned. This joker stays pinned to the leftmost position. Why don't I just go fuck myself then, huh? All right. It doesn't matter what we do then. Um, I want to keep to-do list around just for the plus 50 chips. And if we see any buffoon packs and we'll also hieroglyph here just to, again, slow down the ante a little bit. I don't need Arcana Packs for the Tarot cards. It doesn't really matter right now. Shop an Uncommon Joker. Uh, that's going to eat. So now we at least we have a plus six no matter what we do. Uh, speaking of no matter what we do, we can still kind of just flush our way to victory a little bit. Because um, we've essentially reset ever Like, we've reset the whole game. The only difference is that we're walking into Anti-1 with a plus six on our multi and uh, plus 50 foil chips. It's just... Now, every turn, I need to have another Joker in front of to-do list. Otherwise, it's just going to keep eating. Adds the sell value of all owned Jokers to the left of this card. Well, that's not going to be big. Um, and then Ballot is another plus three. That's plus three. So now I have at least two turns 
Oh, I kind of want to keep hanging, hanging Chad here. Cat, Chad, Chad. Just because it gives a plus 10 multi, which given all of our stuff, that's, you know, actually big. Uh, but this should be a plus 10 here soon anyway, and then another plus six. So I'm not terribly worried about it. Uh, we could also celestial pack, just see what's going on, but I need to save as much money as I can. The rare joker is spooky dookie <laughs> hanging chattius <laughs> uh all cards played previously is anti or debuff that's unfortunate there it is there's there's the, the plus so uh let me just hit that quick flush uh that should one tap it because of our plus 10 our plus 10 and then our, our plus 50 there oh yeah double taps it more than double taps a great googly moogly and we get uh hands remaining a little bit of entrust and uh, let's get our let's get our eight eight dollars uh played face cards we'll just keep buying swashbuckler four dollars to to add um plus two multi is that worth it though and then we'll grab a buffoon pack if we can get an uncommon Ooh, sheesh man Oh, $3. Okay, so all face cards become gold cards when played. I'm going to try to hold on to Midas Mask for a, as long as I can. And the more flushes we play with face cards and, and whatnot, the better it's going to work out for us because it's going to help us generate money, which is going to feed into our ceremonial dagger as long as we have jokers to throw into it. All right. And yes, uh... Hanging Chad is going to be eaten first uh, just because the Ceremonial Dagger's already given us the plus 10 uh, where we need the actual chip value from the foil on the to-do list even though we're most likely never going to fulfill the to-do list. But it's, it is only a full house. How, how hard is a full house to pull off here? Oh, it's impossible. Well, hell. Um, let me just... So this... All face cards become gold cards when played. I don't know if it's played or scored, so we'll see. It's just played. Interesting. Uh, our high card gets us there. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Really, I was really hoping that high card wouldn't get us there, but we are rocking some big multis right now. So, contains a straight. I'll buy, uh, because I think common sell for two no matter what. So, just to save a smidge of money, I'll grab a. I don't know if that rounds up to three, because this one's three, but it's also holographic. So, as far as sell value. Oh no, a negative joker. Well, a negative jokey could be good for us just so that it... We can kind of always have it at the end and have more cards between uh, what I want and what I need. And speaking of what I need, I'm going to try to get a full house here. And we got there. Not only did we get there, but we get three gold kings out of it with Midas. And plus five dollars from our to-do list. Wonderful. <laughs> All right, we're, we're we're getting we're getting rounded. We're getting rounded. We trigger all cards. Oh shit. Okay. So this one sells for five, which is awesome. I love that for us. Um, and then we'll buy that one as well, just to, again, put it in front of, and it's only two. So our ceremonial dagger is growing. Uh, once seltzer is useless to us, we will feed it into our ceremonial dagger for another plus 10 on our multi. Start with zero discards. Quee gives a shit. Our, um, we'll play a pair here. Uh, Midas will convert. All of our golds, which is great. 
Seltzer is doing the work that it should be doing. Retrigger all cards played for the next nine hands. So it's going to be a while before we sell or we feed the Seltzer into it. But that's also fine. I want to test the sell value of this common. Yeah, it is two. So I should have just bought the Jolly Joker and then it would have sold for two into the ceremonial dagger. Meow, meow. One hand per uh nine dollars? Nine dollars? No. No, 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 no. Okay. Let's just get rid of all of that. I need more played. Oh, what's my to-do list? Straight flush. Great googly moogly. Um, so I actually need an eight six of spade. Do I have that available? I do have an eight and a six of spade available. Um, I'm still confident in our high card situation. Now I just need an eight of spade. I, I forgot about the jack of spades as well. A uh, queen of spade is. No, I need that eight. No matter no matter what happens, I need that eight. <sighs> uh, we'll play these just to play it. Uh, our... Hopefully high card doesn't get us there. Because it is only 2,000. Oh, it's three of a kind. Fuck me, it might actually get us there. Yeah. <laughs> no. Why is Goose so stupid? Goose so stupid. All right. Four dollars into the round. Uh, we'll grab the four and we'll feed that into our Dagar. Uh, let's get a Celestial pack here. I still don't know like what we're actually going for uh, when it comes to stuff. Ugh, why is it bad to get it in the first hand uh specifically on that one i was trying to get our to-do list which was a straight flush and we were one cut we were one eight of spades away from getting our straight flush on that one because we had a jack 10 9 7 so i just needed that eight so i was trying to play everything else uh, out of my hand because i was out of discards to search for that eight of spades so i can get that extra five uh, monies. And it's just unfortunate that we didn't get there. $5 per skip. It's $15, though. That's pretty good. Extra large blind. I'm actually a little worried about that one. But we're getting, like, over 2000 anyway. Especially because of Seltzer, because of To-Do List, and, hang and Hang Chad. So, I'll take the 15. But we're getting 5, 9... We're getting at least nine per per play. And then if we have any gold cards in our hand, that's more. So actually, I think we could potentially maybe earn more from not doing the thing. And same situation here. I'm trying to get a uh, seven and a seven six or seven jack of clubs uh it's unlikely there's our seven all right so now i just need the six of clubs uh, or the jack of clubs i'm being greedy death hello i'm being greedy by holding on to my gold cards oh it's not it's not a club <laughs> it was so close uh, I don't think we're gonna get four thousand out of this so we will just convert this into a gold card which is great Please don't get 4,000. 3,000. Perfect. Fuck! No! Well, we don't we don't get our to-do list yet again. Well, hell. I can know Bolebi. So kind of no matter what we do, we get about, um, about what? 3,000-ish per, per hand? Hello? I will grab you. It might be time for hanging, hanging Shad to go away. Because I want to hold on to the Mad Joker. But it could also be time for Seltzer to go away. 
I mean, the retrigger cards is nice and all, but do I want to retrigger the cards or do I want the plus 10 multi, right? And I'm thinking plus 10 multi, and I'll keep the 1.5 multi at the end because it turns a 40 into a 60, and that's really nice. Well, 40, 50, oh god, 25, 75. So we're going to get plus 75 multi no matter what we do. Which is massive. And I still don't know, like, what I'm doing right now. I'm kind of just playing pretty much the best hand I got. Um, speaking of best hand I got, I'm going to go for, uh, I need a three, five of hearts. I have both of that. I still need this, this Royal flush or straight flush, excuse me. So we'll actually do high card here just to not only, uh, convert these into gold cards for for later because like now almost all of my face cards are gold cards which is massive oh we're gonna about five thousand a a rock and roll i'll keep the king oh shit i'll keep the kings as well i just need a three five three five three five we don't get the three five uh no uh, let's do just the ace high card. Perfect. Oh, no, it's not perfect. It's barely, barely over. I was hoping for one more turn. Dude, to-do list is so hard. The only reason I still have it is because of the base 50 chips it's got. Uh, so... My biggest issue right now is... Hanging card is gonna get eaten for plus six... Uh, but all of my face cards are good. So, like, Midas can go away now. Midas can go away. So, I'm fine there. Playing cards can be purchased from the shop. I actually love that idea. It kind of gives us an idea of what to actually do. Yeah. It hurts our, our bank a little bit. But we're also fine. And, oh, but if we're buying cards and even become face cards, we can Midas mask. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Mega buffoon pack. All right. Uh, we're still looking for that straight flush if we can get our hands on it. I don't think this is going to get us there for at least 6,000. Oh, my God. Never mind. Yeah. Okay. Well, hell. <laughs> I was I was hopeful that it wouldn't, but what the fuck do I know when it comes to math, huh? Uh, the first card of every round only has one card. Destroy it, earn three dollars. All right, well let's. Hmm, shit, shit, shit. It's an uncommon. Uncommons sell for three, I believe. So it sells for two. Is it really based off the buy value then? I mean, I'm just, it's its just gonna get eaten by ceremonial dagger. And hanging, hanging Chad doesn't really mean anything to me. So I'm not really worried about it. Doubles my money. I'll grab the 40, I'll grab the 40 money. Absolutely. First hand. Okay, we're just gonna play five and hope for the best. Great. It was almost a straight. Uh, we can sort by suit and rank. So these are lower than the six. This might actually just be a straight, but I know it's not a straight flush, which is unfortunate, but it still gets us, you know. Oh, hey, we got the pair. Let's go. We're one card off a straight, but again, it wouldn't have been a straight flush, so we're fine. I mean, wah, wah, big monies, haunted bones. A four, it doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Consumable slot doesn't really matter for us, at least in this run. Um, The only issue is that hanging Chad is worth more not getting eaten than it is getting eaten. 
because right now not only does it re-trigger the first card because it doesn't matter um you, <laughs> you remember when you thought 100 was a lot i know right i mean back in 10 years ago 100 bucks was a lot of money same thing with the to-do list uh plus six multi is nice but it, right now we're at plus 50 multi so i need multiplication values not just additive values and that's where mad joker is kind of coming in because it's specifically because it's polychromed uh we could lean into the four of a kind schmed here uh let's see what options we got going on i will grab the jack sure i'll grab this one just to feed our hungry hungry dagar doubles my money again Oh, money bags. Goose coming back. Uh, two of a kind. I want more of my gold cards. There's my gold cards. Uh, but they only count if they stay in hand. So we're just going to play our three of a kind. And hopefully we get our nine -ish money at the back end of this as well. Almost gets us there. And we'll just high card for the win. Because we're getting all of our value from not only Ceremonial Dagger, but the 50 from to-do list. Because uh, we're getting the 50 chips from to-do list. So our... Because, like, we don't have any levels on anything. So, like, we're getting no values out of the actual cards we play. But we're getting tons of value from Ceremonial Dagger, the foil to-do list... Uh, creates a tarot card, contains an ace or a straight, must have room. We'll just feed another two. Uh, let's re-roll. Let's grab another ace. Sure thing. Plus 40 chips for each remaining discard. Well, it might be time to get rid of to-do list. Because 40 times 3 is 120 as long as we never discard anything, right? And... 100 and ba 120 base chips is a lot. Especially because we have plus 54 multi off the back of it. So let's sell that. We will eat to do list. We will add Banar. And then we'll reroll one. Um, mm, let's grab a tarot as well. We have so much money. I'm not terribly worried about it. Creates a random joker. Enhances two cards to be bonus cards. Increase the rank of up to two selected cards. We'll increase our two tens. Oh, see? But now, like, the more face cards I have, the more I should have kept Midas. That's also fine. And hilariously, I did test this in one run. If you increase the value of an ace, it doesn't go up to 12 chips. It goes up to a two. Or I should say it resets it to a two. So never strengthen an ace. Um, but I could strengthen a king into a golden ace. And how many aces do we have? Five? <clears throat> Actually, that's not a terrible idea. We'll do a king and a ten here. Because we already have six jacks. So we'll have seven jacks and then six aces. Increasing our likelihood of a four of a kind. Love that idea. Oh, let's reroll one more time. We don't get it. That's fine. Lose $1 per card played. Unfortunate. Growing up, I always played Ace as a low card. So it throws me when it's a high card. It's it's technically both. Um, speaking of both, um, we can get a straight here. I don't know how much I love that. But uh, Banner is going to carry super hard. We're going to miss out on the three chips, but that's also fine. And we're going to go minus $5 for playing it, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine because we're going to we're going to one tap it. Easy. But we are getting to a point where our scaling is slowing down. It's not like dead, but it's slowing down. So. So, oh, okay. I'll take the Jack of Clubs here specifically for the extra chips because that's where I'm hurting the most right now is just base chip value. 
Oh, but a gold seal stone card. So anytime I play the stone card, I just get $3. But more jacks means more mad joker shenanigans. And same thing with the, the ace. Oh, hello. Nope, more jack. All right, nine jacks. Uh, six aces. We have so many jacks. Great googly moogly. Uh, we'll reroll one time. Greedy Jokar. It's cell value of three, so plus six to our ceremonial Dogar. We're missing out on the plus 50 chips for the foil, but that's fine. Not terribly worried about it. And we can one tap. Uh, the, the 20 here with pretty much anything. Uh, and by anything, I mean just here, here's a high card. Meaning we get like pretty much dick all out of it and oh, 16,000. Sheesh, man. No eggs all night. We have been eggless. For sure, we have been absolutely eggless. Uh, I don't want to... We're one card off of a, a straight here, but that's also fine. We're trying not to discard as much as we can because Banner is going to carry super hard. And I want to keep my, my gold cards around for the extra money. Money, money, money. Oh, Goose is so greedy. So greedy. <laughs> Chicken farms must be in decline. <laughs> yeah. Demand for eggs is like super big right now. Sale value of all owned jokers to the left is card. I mean, it, it doesn't matter what we do. We just got to throw something into the ceremonial dagger. I'll grab a mega pack so I can select two out of the five. I will grab that gold card and that's it. Standard pack. I'm looking for aces and jacks, baby. And there's a holographic ace and a jack, but it's a base jack. Get the fuck out of here, base jack. Ooh, gain 15. All face cards are drawn face down. <clears throat> That's unfortunate. 30,000 is going to be an interesting one to hit here just because I still I still don't have like an archetype. My archetype right now is just Joker carry. And I don't know how successful that's going to be. Because that is my archetype of do not discard, play anything, and the Jokers will hopefully get me there. Oh, boy. Uh, all cards are considered face cards. That's super fun. Contains a straight. That's also fun. Celestial pack. So this could actual big determine what we are truly looking for. High card, three of a kind, straight. Three of a kind isn't impossible for us as long as we're getting aces and jacks. So let me actually three of a kind here, huh? And then we'll grab another celestial pack. Uh, I would prefer four of a kind for our mad joker, but four of a kind has been um, elusive to say the least. And on top of that, like we can't really discard because banner is always in play right uh we will uncommon you sell for two oh we should have just bought the devious joker uh let's re-roll mm, nothing 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 it's fine face car is drawn face down ronky all right there's a straight i love to see it all right Honestly, I should have gone high card, like the, the Plutos. But if we're getting about 18, no matter what we do. It's also not bad. Wish there was a pirate. <laughs> but not the killing pillaging pirate. You just want to sail the seas. Wear a pirate hat. Well. Oh, oh, oh. We save money. I'm all about saving money. Uh, Let's grab a Stundard pack. Grab another jack, sure. Arcana. We can get like a death here. It'd be good. Destroy up to two select. Ooh. Sell value of current jokers. $9. Go away. Enhance this two card to multi, which just gives me plus four. I'll destroy in a three and a four. 
Uh, I'll buy that just for now in case there's like nothing else better coming through the pipeline. Um, uh, three of a kind's getting strong, but it's not going to matter. Allow straights to be made with gaps of one rank? Uh, it doesn't matter because we have nothing else that like parries with, pairs with a straight. Great googly moogly. All right, it's fine. It's fine. It's no big deal. It's chill. Uh, here, we're actually going to... Do we hold the ace? We do have six more aces in our deck, but we also have ten total jacks. Oh, my God. Yeah. Let's do it. A fifth of our deck left is jacks. There we go. All right, we hit the three of a kind. Um, one of them is a lucky card. So if we hit the one in five or the one in 15, we also get base 30 chips. And I want... I want the... Hmm, I mean, I'm going to hit it no matter what. I want the lucky card to proc twice for two chances at either the one in five or the one in 15, specifically the one in 15, because I'm greedy. I want that schmowny. It doesn't proc the Mad Joker, which is unfortunate. And it didn't hit either one of them. That's fine. Unfortunate. But we get our Schmuns. Each played Ace. All face cards. We'll do this one again. Again, we're just going to feed the Ceremonial Dagger. It's just a shame that we don't have any kind of scaling cell value. Like the, um, at the end of the turn, add plus one cell to, to everything. Like that Joker here would be so strong for Ceremonial Dag Dagar. Pair? We'll, we'll do a pair, I guess. I don't know. This is, fuck, it's, it doesn't matter. There's nothing there. Convert three into diamonds. Uh, three more face cards to discard at the same time. Uno Moss contains a straight unfortunate. Well, hell. One more. I oh, will high card again. Just to just to level it up a little bit. Each played ace two three five eight gives plus eight multi when scored. Doesn't matter. Honestly, that is a big card. However, it is not the big card we need. Uh, I'm gonna see if it'll re-trigger our gold seal, because it says re-trigger playing first playing card. And I don't think stone card is a playing card in the traditional sense of what gets re-triggered it does awesome thanks for the six money speaking of six money um um i'm gonna do that hoping i mean that should honestly get us like at least another 17 how much does that give us? 25. Yeah, it gets it more than gets us there. And we get $9 from all the gold cards. Uh, one in four chance to upgrade. Honestly, that's really strong. It's sad that it's going away. Grab another ceremonial, I guess. High card, a pair, four of a kind. Ugh. Ugh. All right, we'll grab, we'll grab the high card. Just because, like, we don't want to discard that much right now, if, if at all. So, and we've been playing, like, yeah, 11 times we've played a high card. So, just having that boosted a little bit. Uh, doubles my money. Sure, max of 20. Sure, give me a plus 18. Nom, 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 nom. Free. Free. What's the best planet other than Earth and the solar system? I mean, I wouldn't say Earth is the best either. Jupiter is pretty impressive. Uh, Venus is also really cool. Just as far as like what planets do and how they like interact with themselves. I mean, Jupiter has like what? 12 moons or something. Earth minus humans is great. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Too much going on. You know what I mean? All the other planets are simple. Uh, what am I doing? <laughs> One in seven cards drawn face down. Well, hell. 
our ceremonial dagger is big, but we have nothing to... We have a 1.5 and like, that's it. That's not a lot to work on right now. I'm going to play the high card here, looking for either a jack or an ace. We hit the jack. Uh, we'll hit that down face card as well. If it's another jack, I'm going to scream. Um, because, I mean, yeah, I'll, we'll get the plus 20 multi out of it, so it won't be that bad. It's not. Let's go! Big. And it doesn't matter really what we play here, uh, but we do get our three of a kind as well. And we're going to get uh, 12 bucks for our gold card. Dude, Goose is so greedy. Goose is so greedy. But we're going to be able to like hard reroll these next shops. Looking for something absolutely spiced and juiced and gassed. So. Ah! 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 Bootstraps. All right, what do we have? Uh, 150 divided by five is 30. Yeah, it's about 30, I think, right? 30? So that gives us plus 60. Wow, a ceremonial dagger. You're shit. <laughs> hmm. All right, hanging card, you're, you're dead to me. Because we got bootstraps now. Uh, we will plus one card in the shop. Thank you, thank you. Uh, the only issue with that is now we have to be like three of a kind. Ah! Business goose, if you put that $154 in the stock market, oh, I can make big returns in 50 years? I'll, I'll turn $154 into uh, seven cents. Watch, just fucking watch me. All right, um, we'll just kind of play whatever. Oh my God. All right, so we're getting 34 a hand for doing nothing, which is nice. I love that. Uh, we're also going to, oh yeah, we don't have our double play first card anymore. Uh, I do like the ace here, but I want to hold on to my gold card because I'm greedy. Uh, and then this three of a kind is going to get us over the finish line. And now, if anything, our gold cards are even more important because of bootstraps. Oh, greedy goose. Greedy goose. Um, And uh, to maintain greed. Bought for one, sell for one, plus two. Okay. Jupiter. Hmm. Right up is the two common jokers. Queen gives a shit. Forces one card to always be selected. That's unfortunate. Not impossible, just unfortunate. I should have played the, the joker as well. Joker, it's a jack! Speaking of, we'll hit it with a two pair. Uh, Just please don't Give me another... Oh, balls. <laughs> I was... I didn't want the full value there. I was hopeful that it was going to be like 74. So I had more time to get some more gold cards on the field. Well, hell. Next round is it. You sell for two. You sell for two. You sell for three. Uh, Will... Ceremonial Zagar's up to 92... I'll buy one. Hmm. Into a steel card. I love that idea. We'll, we'll grab a steel here just for like an absolutely heater of a hand. The only issue is that one card is always selected. So I guess chariot's useless. So it's 90 by nine or seven by, or 60 by seven. The only difference is this is giving us a plus 20 at the end of it all. This is giving us a nine at the start of it. So we're only losing out on, on plus two when it comes to the multi and bootstraps and ceremonial dagger. D doesn't give a shit about that 
small difference. Um, but what does matter is the base chip value where this 10, we're still, we're still, what is it like 20 short? Cause we're getting 90, 100, 120, 60, 100. Yeah, we're, we're 20, 20 short. So what we're going to do is do the lucky card with the extra chips. And then we'll toss in a four and a seven here as well, just to get them out of my hand. Um, I can't really enhance any of these into a steel card because I have to select the card to turn it into a steel card and I can't deselect because of the fucking force is one card to always be selected. So chariot was just a, a waste of time and energy. 600 or oh, 66, excuse me. Uh, we'll just grab a quick little pair here yeah and that's gonna get us over over the line as well i believe yes sir yes sir Whew. ceremonial dagger it got a little intense there for a second because we just had to keep feeding it but i think we got really lucky with our blind skips because we were just able to just generate enough money to always feed dagger if we didn't get lucky on the amount of money we were able to generate and we were like well i can't afford to feed dagger what am i gonna do and i think the the biggest brain play we did there was slowing everything down by buying the hieroglyph to keep growing dagger earlier rather than trying to force feed it later 